So I'm wrapping up this Daewoo Puma 2500 MS LSY turret. This surface right here, this is a live tool drive. This is a housing. Uh, this surface has to be parallel with x-axis travel. The tool plate has to be parallel with x-axis travel. And then up inside, up inside here, there's a live tool drive. And that has to be centered in that hole. So when you get x-axis, that, that drive unit parallel to x-axis travel, that's gonna be lined up. And this, so that slot has to be lined up perfect too. It has to be the tools, the tools orient against this plate right here. Uh, that's what keeps the tool straight. If this, if this, this drive right here is turned, it's gonna crash. And that's what this whole problem is about. So that, and the way you adjust that, if that's, if that's off, you're gonna use parameter 4077 to adjust that. It's not focusing or else I just got my camera dirty. Forty seventy seven. This one's at twenty four hundred. There it is. Spindle two. If it is a spindle. Not only do you have to adjust that. Let me move this forward. There's a taper lock. That taper lock right there. And this detent right here. You need to loosen up that taper lock and that will let you spin that live tool. And uh, you can basically, if you orient the turret, it's gonna go to 24 parameter 4077. It's gonna go to 2400. You can just loosen it up, loosen this taper lock up and spin that live tool with the wrench and get it perfect. You don't have to mess with the parameters in. And this, this is the air cylinder, and that has to be back, and it has to make these switches right here. I'm shaking. It has to make these switches right here. Those switches, if, if, it's, if that cylinder is not back, it's it's not <laughs> it's not going to spin. And if it's forward, and if it's not making that proc switch, it's not going to index. So those proc switches.